Off to the airport. By Vegas. And here comes our Lyft driver. Morning, how you doing? Oh crap, drop my cup. All right, thank you. Where do we go from? Where do we go from here? We're at the airport and we're actually flying American first class. We'll see how it goes. So they say, um, Las Vegas talks a good game, but as far as social distancing in the airport, there's no space in the seats. It's just all packed in. We'll see how they do with the uh, with the plane. Good morning. So put your hand in mine. I will be there every day when you're sick. It's only the first leg in the 737. So the nice seats, but 737. The second leg should be really nice. Just give us water. Scotty and hand sanitizer. Seats are company. Got in flight. It's a full flight because they were standing. Yeah, it doesn't seem that they're distancing this flight out at all. Again, American Talk's a good game, but they're just doing the standard old everybody crowding through crap. Thanks. Us? Oh, you're in the window, baby. Oh, okay. Wow. Now this is first class. <laughs> It goes down into a bed. Yeah. Well, that'll work. Look at that. Custom. And you can go all the way down, or this is where I'm going. That's awesome. I can't get used to this, but this is nice. I could do this if we fly over to Asia. But we'll probably be back there. Because, yeah, it's a little bit much for Asia. He's playing. <laughs> Maybe we shouldn't have actually booked these. We now know what we want in the future. I'm sitting backwards. It's been a while since I sat backwards in a plane. Oh yeah, cheese and crackers. And a Coke. I'm watching Little Women. Cheese and coffee, gotta love it. But seriously, American Airlines is doing nothing for distancing. Alaska was way better on that.
That's my little bag. That's her big bag. First class, I can see why people spend so much money on it. That was wonderful. You can lay flat. You have your own little space, plenty of leg room. It's the way to go. And I really would like to do it all the time. If it wasn't so expensive. <laughs> This ended up working out really well for us. We had a non-stop flight from Vegas to Miami. However, American Airlines changed at the last minute and took us through Dallas, so we had to change planes. But instead of being on a 737 the whole time, we got to be on the 777 with those nice lay flat beds and actual menu service and all that for the whole second part of the trip. So I think that maybe makes up to Katie for that little trip we took first class in Cancun to Miami where we didn't even get water. No food because of the coronavirus and no drinks. Like no water. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. It really did. Oh, and the bathrooms were twice, uh, even three times as big as the, you know, the cattle call in the back. They were really nice. It was amazing. <laughs> Welcome to Miami. This is my idea of a white Christmas. The purple flags mean stay away from these things, the Portuguese man of wars. So every year I try and push my comfort zone, and this year I have two weeks to do that. And that's how you do Christmas Eve, Katie and Chris style. And we're in the south, and I've never been to a Winn Dixie, so we're gonna go explore one. You freaking thought. Leave the thumbs up and subscribe. Oh, no, that was good. That was good. That was good. <laughs>